Hello and welcome, creature enthusiasts, to our channel Begin Any Moment. We're thrilled to have you join us on this thrilling adventure as we unveil the mysteries of the wild. If you're new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon, so you're always in the loop with our latest explorations. And to our loyal subscribers, we see you and appreciate your support. Today we're embarking on a journey that's sure to raise the hairs on the back of your neck. So grab your popcorn, settle in, and let's dive into today's video. Are you ready to face the creatures that could give a T-Rex a run for its money? Ever thought there could be animals scarier than dinosaurs? Imagine waking up in the middle of a Jurassic Park sequel, only to find it's not a T-Rex you're up against. Welcome to a world where nightmares are real and the monsters are closer than you think. In this video, we're diving into the realm of the terrifying and the bizarre, counting down 10 creatures that could give a T-Rex a run for its money. We're ranking these beasts based on their size, their extraordinary abilities, and the sheer terror they would instill in us humans if we were to cross paths. From the depths of the ocean to the heart of the jungle, we'll explore the habitats of these creatures and why they're more frightening than our prehistoric friends. So prepare yourself and maybe keep the lights on. Hold on tight, because we're about to embark on a journey that will make you appreciate the safety of your own home. Kicking off our countdown at number 10, we have the Honey Badger. Don't let its sweet name fool you. This pint-sized powerhouse is the epitome of ferocity, resilience, and fearlessness. It's like the tough guy in the animal kingdom who never backs down, no matter how big the other guy is. Ever heard of David versus Goliath? Well, let's talk about Honey Badger versus, say, a lion. Yes, you heard right. These little brutes have been known to attack predators many times their size, including lions, just to protect their meal or their cubs. And if that's not enough, Honey Badgers can survive venomous snake bites that would take down creatures 10 times their size. This is due to a specialized protein in their blood that neutralizes venom, making them practically invincible against some of the deadliest snakes on the planet. So, who needs dinosaurs when a bite-sized fluff of rage like the honey badger exists? He's slithering into the ninth spot, we have the cone snail. Yes, a snail. Now don't let its small size fool you. This little gastropod is one of the most venomous creatures on Earth. The cone snail lurking in the warm waters of the tropics is a master of disguise. It sports an exquisite shell that can easily entice anyone into picking it up. But beware, for this seemingly innocent snail hides a deadly secret. Packed with a venom potent enough to paralyze and kill humans, the cone snail is no less than a miniature weapon of mass destruction. It's like a tiny slimy sniper armed with a harpoon-like tooth that it uses to inject its lethal cocktail into its prey. This unassuming beachcomber's nightmare proves that size doesn't always matter when it comes to danger. So next time you're combing the beach for pretty seashells, remember, not all danger comes in large packages. Sometimes it's the size of a seashell. Claiming the eighth spot, we have the Komodo dragon. And no, it doesn't breathe fire, but that doesn't make it any less terrifying. Now you might be thinking, it's just a big lizard, right? Well, not exactly. This creature, my friends, is the largest living lizard on our planet, reaching lengths of up to three meters. That's about the size of a small car. But size isn't the only thing that makes this creature daunting. Imagine a lizard with shark-like teeth and a venomous bite. Yes, you heard that right. The Komodo dragon's saliva is a deadly cocktail of bacteria and venom. This lethal combination can bring down prey much larger than itself. It's like having a stealthy slithering land shark in the wild, and where can you find this living dinosaur? Well, they're native to Indonesia, roaming freely in the wild, and occasionally stopping by local villages. So next time you're planning a trip to Indonesia, you might want to rethink your itinerary. Swimming into the seventh spot, we have the saltwater crocodile. This is one swim you don't want to join. Now let's talk about size. The saltwater crocodile is the largest living reptile on the planet, with males reaching lengths of up to 23 feet. Imagine that. That's roughly the length of a small moving truck. The real danger, however, lies in their incredible strength and stealth. These creatures are notorious man-eaters with a bite force that could crush a car. They're cunning hunters, lying in wait under the water's surface, ready to snap up unsuspecting prey. They're not picky eaters either. Anything that strays too close is fair game. 
and let's not forget about their habitat range. From the mangroves of northern Australia to the marshes of Southeast Asia, these reptilian giants rule their watery domains with an iron jaw. So remember, if you're ever in northern Australia or Southeast Asia, stick to the swimming pools. Stomping into the sixth spot, we have the African elephant. Size does matter after all. This majestic beast, the largest land animal on our planet, packs an impressive punch with both its sheer size and strength. It's not just a matter of brawn, though. With a brain three times the size of a human's, these giants are remarkably intelligent. Their memory, too, is legendary, making them formidable when they feel threatened or are protecting their young. Imagine for a moment being out in the wild, and you accidentally cross paths with a protective elephant mother. You wouldn't want to be on the receiving end of a charge from a six-ton powerhouse, would you? But it's not about fear, it's about respect. These incredible creatures command our awe and our admiration. So next time you're on a safari, remember, it's their territory, not ours. Be mindful, be respectful, and you'll get to witness the true majesty of the African elephant. Charging into the fifth spot, we have the African buffalo. This is one buffalo you don't want to mess with. The African buffalo, or Cape buffalo as it's often called, is a heavyweight in the animal kingdom. Weighing in at a whopping 1,500 pounds and standing tall at nearly six feet, it's no pushover. This buffalo is not only known for its size and strength, but also for its temperament. Let's just say, it's not the friendliest creature you'll come across on an African safari. Dubbed as the Widowmaker, or Black Death, it has a notorious reputation for killing more hunters on the African continent than any other animal. When threatened, it charges with a speed of up to 35 miles per hour. And those horns, they're not just for show. They can seriously injure, even kill. So think twice before you decide to go on that hunting trip. Hopping into the fourth spot, we have the poison dart frog, small but deadly. Now don't let their size fool you. These little amphibians pack a punch. They're like the tiny, colorful ninjas of the animal kingdom. Their skin, believe it or not, is a lethal weapon. It secretes a potent toxin, potent enough to kill predators and humans alike. That's right, one touch could spell the end. It's like they're wearing a poison cloak, only it's not a fashion statement, it's a survival strategy. And let's talk about their vibrant colors. Reds, blues, yellows, and greens. It's not to win the best dressed in the rainforest. These colors are a stark warning to potential predators. A loud visual shout of back off, buddy. Despite their deadly nature, they're a fascinating part of our biodiversity, showing us that size doesn't always matter when it comes to being a formidable foe. So remember, not all frogs are princes in disguise. Drifting into the third spot, we have the box jellyfish. This is one jelly you don't want to step on. Now let's dive deeper into the realm of the ocean's deadliest, the box jellyfish. Its venom is so potent that it can cause heart failure in humans. Imagine that, a creature so small, yet its sting can stop a human heart. This marine marvel is as beautiful as it is dangerous, with up to 15 tentacles sprouting from each corner of its bell-shaped body. Each of these tentacles is lined with thousands of stinging cells known as cinetocytes that are activated by the mere touch of a prey or a predator. But here's the real kicker, the box jellyfish is nearly invisible, that's right. This translucent terror is virtually undetectable in its natural habitat, which only adds to its menace. So the next time you're frolicking in the ocean, remember, there could be a nearly invisible, heart-stopping creature lurking beneath. So next time you're at the beach, watch your step. Buzzing into the second spot, we have the mosquito. Yes, you heard right. A tiny creature, the mosquito, is one of the most dangerous animals on the planet. It's not the mosquito itself that's the menace, but the deadly passengers it carries. With a single bite, a mosquito can transmit diseases like malaria and dengue fever. Malaria, a disease as old as humanity itself, is responsible for hundreds of thousands of deaths each year. It's a silent killer, creeping up on its victims with symptoms that can easily be mistaken for a common cold. Dengue, on the other hand, is a newer threat. It's been dubbed breakbone fever for the severe joint pain it inflicts. Despite their size, mosquitoes are a force to be reckoned with. They've been around for over 30 million years, so they've had plenty of time to perfect their craft. So, 
Remember, sometimes the smallest creatures are the deadliest. And finally, claiming the top spot, we have the human. Surprised? Humans, fascinating creatures that we are, have a unique capacity for destruction. Not only to other species, mind you, but to the very planet we call home. We've created weapons capable of wiping out entire cities in the blink of an eye. We've cut down forests, polluted oceans, and even changed the climate. It's like we're on a one-species mission to outdo every terrifying creature that's ever roamed the Earth. But let's not forget, we also possess an incredible capacity for intelligence, creativity, and ambition. We've cured diseases, landed on the moon, and created works of art that can move people to tears. It's this duality, this ability to create and destroy in equal measure that makes us truly unique. And maybe, just maybe, a little bit scarier than any dinosaur. So who needs dinosaurs when we have ourselves? Stay safe out there, folks.